Another thing that he tells us is not to waste time. He uses the language of wukuf zamani. There is wukuf zamani, there's wukuf adadi, wukuf qalbi. These are three technical terms that they use in the medicine chest of human illnesses. And wukuf zamani means to be aware of the passage of time. Don't waste time. What time of day is it? How have I used my time this day? How will I use my time for the rest of this day? Because the lower self wants us to kill time, to waste time, to fritter it away. The higher self knows that every breath is a capital that diminishes. Sarmaye Omr, the capital of the life. A certain amount of days that you've been given, and they always go down and never go up again. They diminish, so watch out, carpe diem. Be attentive to the time. This in our age of distraction, when so many huge entertainment corporations are making inconceivable mountains of money out of people's desire to be distracted and to ignore even basic family tasks just through entertainment, just through foolish games. This doesn't mean that we can't be entertained and that we can't play games. Ours is the way of balance. But when it's too much, it's bad for the soul, it's bad for the brain, it's bad for our lives because most of those things are a wasting of time. So this is important as well, to be aware of time, to stand with the time, as he puts it. To think at the end of each day, how have I used my time? To think at the beginning of the day, even if briefly and informally, what am I going to be doing today and what are the priorities that I should have? Let me do the important things first, not the easy things first. This is part of a basic discipline that even outside the religious world is something that is going to help you towards success. But we want it to help us in this transcendence, though we move from the world of instinct and 